Hello everyone, my name is Basket Lockerball and today we're doing a restaurant challenge. This is what we're taking on here. Giant roast beef sandwich. This gentleman was able to take it down. We'll see if I can do the same. All right guys, I'm here at Anthony's in Tewksbury here to take on their giant roast beef challenge. I think it's called the Beano challenge, something like that. This is only the challenge, but I wanted to make it actually challenging, so I got a second sub. Forget the name of it, it's barbecue chicken, mozzarella sticks. The total weight of both of these is around 10 pounds, something like that, depending on the weight of the boxes. Could you go over the just the rules for the actual challenge for me? Yeah, so you gotta eat the whole beef beano okay. in one sitting Okay. Um, and report it. Okay, sounds good. That's it. Um, just one sitting, no no time limit or anything Correct. like that? Okay. Do you get anything if you complete it? The t-shirt. The t-shirt? Yeah. Okay, awesome. And am I going over exactly what's what's yes. in it? So that's our roast beef. Okay. And then it's our homemade onion rings. Yeah. And then it's three-way, which would be James Clipper barbecue sauce, mayo, and American cheese. Sounds good. Awesome. Okay. And... This is the crypto fever. Okay. It's got our homemade chicken fingers. Yep. Mozzarella sticks, bacon, uh, and golden barbecue sauce. Okay, nice. All right, sounds good. Okay. I think the quickest someone's done that is like 16 minutes. Or 16 minutes? I think so, but oh, wow. I'll, I'll try that's to pull fast. it up and check. Yeah. It was fast. Okay. Wow. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna go for speed. Probably, maybe, probably not. Cause no, because she's doing both. So, so yeah. yeah. Well, I'm not. I'm not really a speed eater anyway. Yeah. But anyway. Yeah. 16 minutes, that's impressive though. So. Right? Let me get that. <laughs> Was that the guy with the cowboy hat? Yeah. I saw it on yeah. this event. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Did you see how long it took up? I don't remember what the yeah. caption said. I'll, I'll yeah. pull it up with that. Okay, sounds right. good. good Thank you, appreciate it. All right, since this one is the challenge, I'm going to focus on this one first, then we'll do the second one. All right, guys, I think the time has come. My friends, my fans, my family, this is the giant beef beano challenge. I'm hungry, I'm happy. Let's eat. Timer started. Put it there, should be in focus. Let's dig in. All right guys, welcome to the video and welcome to my first restaurant challenge in nine months. Well, Six months if you count the trip to Vegas. I'm still so grateful to Matt Stoney for that experience. Anyway, we're at a place called Anthony's. I think that's the name of the owner as well. Taking on their massive beef beano roast beef sandwich challenge. Now this sandwich is a regular item on their menu and they actually have like five or six massive sandwiches to choose from. So in an effort to make this actually challenging for me, I ordered a second one. We'll find out if that ends up being a wise decision or not. Hopefully a delicious decision though. Well that sauce has a little bit of kick to it. It's nice, I like it. The sauce helps to make everything go down easier so I probably won't need a lot of liquid, which is good because this is probably like 10 pounds. So conserving liquid will be good. The roast beef didn't require much chewing. Any really. So luckily this first sandwich went down fairly easy, which is good because the second one was not so easy as you'll soon find out. Well, hopefully you do if you stick around for the rest of the video. But most of the roast beef is gone at this point looks like, so now we're getting into the onion rings, mayonnaise, and American cheese, which those three combined was the highlight of this sandwich for me, especially those onion rings, spectacular. Oh, those onion rings are fantastic. Wow, really, really good. I might be able to fold this and kind of make a sandwich out of what got, we got left. Oh, this is gonna be very messy. Yeah, full disclosure, this is a messy challenge. I did what I could to keep my face clean and I think I did an admirable job of that but my hands were very sticky already. It's great that they put rolls of paper towels out on the tables too. I went through my fair share of them. 
Now, I tried eating this as a regular sandwich as I got closer to the end of it, but I quickly abandoned that because it was just getting so, so messy. So I decided, you know what, let me cut it again and then eat the two quarters by itself. So that went a little bit more smoothly and that was nice. So we're almost done with the first sandwich at this point. Okay, seven and a half minutes. We got this part of the bread left of the first one. Luckily the sauce softens the bread up, makes it easier to go down because the bread will likely be the most difficult part. Okay, 10 minutes. I'm gonna call that done on the first one. That might be a new record, I'm not sure they were gonna check, but that was really good. They used a lot of mayonnaise on the bottom. All right, let me remove this. Still going. Now for the barbecue chicken. So that was 10, 11 minutes to take down the beef beano sandwich, I think. Yay! <laughs> now we still have the crypto sandwich to go, which is essentially a barbecue chicken sandwich. I thought this one was gonna be the easier of the two, but it's actually more difficult. The fried mozzarella sticks and fried chicken, they don't go down as smoothly as the roast beef. We'll see how it goes. Ooh. I set up my camera in the vicinity of where the kitchen was. I did that so I could get someone's attention more easily if I needed to, but I could see the kitchen from where I was sitting as well. So that's why I kept looking to my left throughout the video. I'm just not used to having so much activity in front of me while I'm filming, but it was kind of nice. It was like a little entertainment while I'm sitting there eating. All right guys, 16 minutes. Sauce is starting to get to me a little bit. Let me break this up a little. Trying to make a sub. Remember when I said the bread would likely be the most difficult part of this? Well, that turned out to be wrong. It was the sauce. The flavor of it was really starting to wear on me at this point. I'm starting to drink a lot more water as well. It's getting rough. I still had plenty of stomach space, so I knew I could do it, but it was a matter of willpower. About to hit 22 minutes. Really slowed down. The sauce is really getting to me. But we're not done yet. And while we continue, I want to give a couple shout outs. One to the restaurant for turning off the music. I super appreciate that. And two to the longtime subscriber who gave me the shirt I'm wearing. Thank you so much. 26 and a half. Oh, really good subs. Good barbecue sauce, but that's really, really getting to me now. I thought the bread would be the most difficult, but no, it's the sauce. Oh. Oh. Pro tip during a food challenge if you're struggling. Break the food up and make it smaller and have small goals. That's why I kept cutting the sandwich halfway through. I was thinking, let me focus on this small section and not on everything that I have left. You're essentially playing mind games with yourself, but it really does help. Now I was taking big swigs of water at this point as well. Not a good sign because the water really fills you up more, but I just needed some different kind of flavor than that sauce. It was so intense. How's it going? <laughs> what are you doing? Eating YouTube channel? Yeah, food challenge. Yeah, I'm trying to eat their massive uh, sub. Oh, uh, what's your hat on YouTube? Oh, uh, right here, Basket Locker Ball. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> really good subs, but I'm feeling it right now. Yeah, good thing. It's heavy. Augusta, you said, right? Yeah, it's called Augusta's. Augustus, okay. Explosion, make sure you get it on the white thing you wrap. Got it, okay. I'll, rem I'll, I'll remember that. Thank you. <laughs> Very nice gentleman who was intrigued by my camera setup. <laughs> Always fun interacting with people when I'm doing a challenge. He told me about another local food joint near me, Augusta. Maybe they also have a food challenge. You never know. <sighs> 34 minutes. Time is good, but 
Oh, I am feeling it. Okay. This is all we got left. I'm going to break it up. Okay, we're almost there. Only two small sections to go. Come on, dig deep. You can do it. Yeah. Can I do me a favor? Yeah. Could you get me a can of Diet Pepsi? Perfect, thank you. <laughs> Save me the trip. <laughs> ah. Diet Pepsi. Hopefully it helps this last bit go down. Oh. I'm really full, I'm really sick of barbecue sauce, but we don't got much left. Ugh. Let's see if we can't finish it. All right, we're down to the last little bit. We'll see if the Diet Pepsi comes in handy, but I'm out of here. Thanks for watching and I'll see you later. Ah. Done. Oh. 45 minutes and eight seconds. My favorite of the two was the barbecue chicken one. Mr. Jeff Esper, if you're watching, let's see how fast you can take down two of these. I wanna say 25 minutes. ARB Tewksbury. I swallowed 18 inches of beef, beef and I have a video to prove it. <laughs> I saw they had giant chocolate chip cookies, but yeah, I'm way too full to do that. Maybe next time.